The forest is a part of me. The forest is essential for life on Earth. It produces the oxygen we breathe and drinks the carbon dioxide that's warming our planet. It slows down climate change. Forests also breathe, listen, and answer. They are home to 80% of the world's terrestrial biodiversity. They are home to me. I grew up in the most forested region in Kenya. Trees ahead, bushes beside me, the fresh breath, whistling winds around tree trunks, trees lashing and crashing against each other like drumsticks in the hands of a giant, birds singing, the frequent rains, the sun rays making their way through green leaves. There's that special feeling of peace and tranquility in nature at its most pristine. Clean streams and rivers flowing through the forests shielded by the natural cover from trees. My favorite place in a forest is sitting among the trunks of the trees watching the streams and rivers flow. I remember planting my first tree when I was seven years old. I became part of the forest and the forest became part of me. It breaks my heart when I see my forest landscape destroyed, burned down, whole networks of trees cut down faster than you can snap your fingers and streams becoming highways for plastic waste. We have allowed greed and money to drive us, and it's robbing my forests of its life, its goodness, its home. I drank from these waters when I was little. I ran and played and dreamed among these trees. Now I feel the pain of my landscape. What hurts the forest hurts me too. I am who I am today because of my landscape. The forest has been and will forever be my greatest teacher. I spend time with her, listen to her, understanding her, and learning from her. That is why today I am co-creating with her, crying for her destruction, recognizing her rights, and fighting for her life so we can all again feel her joy of abundance. I am ready to restore forests. Are you with me?